Right, and that's stretch worth everybody. But um, the church is still under repair again. It was under repair last time I came here. Um, and there's a lot of workmen in there with very loud, mu loud radio on. So I've just come in this side for now. And I can see a Clayton over there. I've probably got all these recorded in the past, don't forget. There used to be a Stuckville in here. And he is obviously still buried here. Um, I don't even know if I'll bother going in there, you know. Don't you? No. I'm not sure yet. They've got really loud music. There's three rough looking blokes, builders in there. The uh, little Sony's playing up at the moment. Of course, they were all staring at me, so it makes me feel a bit uncomfortable, actually. Um, yeah, I've done all these graves in the past, and there were um, relevant people in, in here. Uh -huh. mm. There are relevant people with the Claydons around here. Yeah, there was there were some relevant people. This looks quite a recent one, Sheila. It's Griffins. Died in 2023. This person did. Queenie Florence Griffin. Looks like she reached 100. Hmm. But there used to be a Stuckville right at the top when I first came here. But uh, the grave disappeared. But they are buried here. Oh yeah, there's Nellie Jaggard. I'm going to do any names that are relevant still. Ne I can't use the other thing at the moment. It's packed, playing up. Nellie Jaggard, who fell asleep March 1944, age See the 31 or 81. That's a jaguard. I bet they're just having their breakfast. Well, it is, I get having their breakfast before they start work. Because it's, um, what time is it? It's just gone nine. As they've been here earlier. Um, what I'm going to do is sort of go up and back and forth. So I'm, going to, I'm not going to have the video on all the time. Basically, I'm just this is an introduction. I've, I've only got today, really, and I've got a fit in Dullingham, which would just be a quick walk round, and then Borough Green I've got flowers for. I've, mm, I've got flowers for that one. Right, I'm going to turn off for a bit just to say, oh no, here we go. Here we've got, um, here we've got another Jaguard. We've got Robert William Jaguard, who died February the 15th, 1961, age 80. And Mary Jaguard, who died February the 22nd, 1973, age 93. So I'm going to turn off and take a picture of that and then... Before I do that, here's that Edward Richard Claydon, who died May the 3rd, 1968, 84, and Alice Minnie Claydon, who died February the 25th, 1969, age 79. Because we've got Claydons, don't forget, in the family. And Briggses, and the Briggses are over there. Right. Looks like they're very busy in the other side of the graveyard. I'm not sure if I'm going in there or not. But this is the other side. There used to be a Stuckville grave in here. Somewhere around here it was. But there's a little sign here. They don't 
apparently we unfortunately we do not have a record of all the unmarked graves if you're able to let us know whose grave this is please email us to lilyweimer at gmail.com or 01638-507-576 handy to keep numbers like that anyway um, I don't know who this one is this is the trouble we I have got records of this probably on an audio cassette by the way it'll be on an audio cassette So this is when they've mowed, they've um, broken that. And here's another one, another grave. Um, for all we know, this could be the Stuttville grave that was here. And I might still have an image of this. And if I have, I can pass it on to them. Now, the, this is the first time, because it's been cleared a bit, that I've been able to see in through here there's a big mansion I never noticed before with like great big wings of some animal. It's right over there in there. Yeah. So I'm now in a minute, I'm off to Dullingham. I'm not sure whether I'm going in there because it's like three boats. Um, hovering about and having their breakfast I think in memory of Ray Duffy Diffy yeah there's a big picture of the mansion I get up on the bench oh yeah they got uh, eagles they look like eagles to me I've never seen that mansion before look I'm going to take a picture. I'll just zoom into the creatures, which look like eagles landing on the back of something. Oh, watch. There's two. Two eagles. I think they're eagles. That must be Dullingham House or something like that. Not Dullingham, Stetchworth. Here we've got William Charles right, Clayton, who died November 1955, aged 70, and um, his son William, he died 1947, aged 41. That's another Clayton grave. There. There's another Amos by here and a Susan by. They were somewhere in the family, these ones. Let's turn off again. These will be very short videos. Sheila, a brief visit to Stetchworth, and they're still doing the church. When I came here about five years ago, they had done the f under the floor, and they've been doing some rendering outside, I believe. I can. I've got. I've got um, images of this place from 20 years ago and it was still oldie worldy, very oldie worldy. But of course that's still there. So this is Stetchworth everyone. Oh yeah, Richard Lord Gorge Baron of Dunkettdeld in the Kingdom of Ireland and Bridget his wife. They're buried in the vaults here. Well, it's basically it's having a really good makeover. Somebody's spending money on it. 
They've done all the flooring a couple of years back and the, and the roof and it hasn't got that musky smell of oldness that it used to have. It really smelled of damp. I wouldn't be surprised if it ain't got underground flooring. And all the floor had been taken up when I was here before. So this is Stetchworth. A little bit more video on the outside. And they're doing all the rendering outside. Everything, the graves will be exactly the same as they always were. Uh, the big manor house next door, it's just a, a stables now. Oh, well, it's a big house, but they do the stables for the racing. Mm. Yeah, because when I came here before, there were big holes going down to the vaults. It was all exposed here. They dug down deep. Um, it's probably the odd grave around here as well. We've got Briggs's and Claydon's and Clayton's here. There's the stables there, 1883. It's a lot clearer than it used to be. Yeah, a lot of these are graves around here, us. All right, there you go. Oh, all right. Thank you, love. At least you've got some music to keep me going. <laughs>